Hello and welcome to episode 102 of our Midlands map. In the background we have some class 101 action going over the viaduct. We are of course in Wolverhampton. We have some signals to update here at some point. Uh, we're on the bridge heading to what is for our map the terminus for the Wolverhampton tram service of the Midland Metro. Is that right? It might be. And uh, yes, the, the viaduct in the background is heading into Wolverhampton Station, which rather apt, isn't it? Because we are we are working on Walsall and we are going to connect Wolverhampton and Walsall together in a fashion. And there will be services traveling between the two. Now, what are we doing today? We've got a busy one today. Definitely busy. <laughs> How busy and why is it busy? I'll let you know. We have got to... Uh, do a little bit of more detail into Walsall. Not not going crazy with it because there's a time limit now, isn't there? We don't know the exact date. However, the last developer's diary for Transport Fever 2 happened very recently. And oh my word, did that make me happy. The amount of control you have over an individual line now is my is is right up my alley, I can say. That you you can change what goods you want. Per line, per stop. Yeah, not just per line. That's what you can do now. But you can do it per uh, per stop, which is which is amazing. The amount of configurations you can you can do there. Goodness me, are we looking forward to that? I know I am. Uh, I hope some of you who watch this manage to get into the BT. You probably can't say anything about it, but congratulations to you guys. I'm going to be working tires tires tirelessly get your words out sir <laughs> on, on this map until it's released and there may be a bit of crossover the technical difficulties we'll be experiencing today will be that of the junction kind and trying to fit in an awful lot of junctioning is that a word junctioning maybe uh between between walsall and bescott sidings and then linking up to our existing pieces of network both this way at Wolverhampton and at Birmingham so <laughs> should we get on with it because uh, we're not going to get much done if I sit here staring at the uh, the lovely tram service of Midlands Metro there so we're going to take a quick look before we head off to Walsall at uh, a class 101 heading into Wolverhampton and uh I just want to quickly say I've got a brand new graphics card now. My computer build is finished for the foreseeable future, hopefully. Uh, I've got an RTX 2080 Super. And uh, that means uh, RTX is on or something. I don't know. Obviously, it matters not in Transport Fever. But it is it's smoother. And I've, I've tested Trainsim World. And uh, that runs a lot smoother. So uh, we'll be having some in world action at some point as well but you're not here to see that shall we get on with it and head to Walsall and uh, do what I've been putting off which is oh dear best got sidings yeah it, it's a monster and we don't have the room for it and you'll see why shortly right let's get over there should we bring up the UI what's the date we are in 1982 in fact we're towards the end of 1982 it's just a stone's throw on this map from uh, Wolverhampton to Walsall. Unfortunately, because that doesn't lend us ourselves to a lot of room to create uh, the junctions required. As you can see, I've had to improvise here. This doesn't really exist. It, it doesn't do this. But I spent several hours trying to get this to work. Yes, trying to swing round is going to be difficult. We've also got to squeeze in, this is the M6, it possibly the M6, that's the M6. Has got to really come round sharper than it normally does. Go parallel with the track that scoots past here. We're going to be a lot closer to Wensbury. I mean, it is what it is, isn't it? it that's what we've got to do. And I believe that is supposed to be the M6 as well. We might have to shuffle that round a little bit. This is the technical difficulties I was talking about. I have put in the bridge. Ah, that's in. That's after the station. I would like to get that in. We've also 
made use of the new fancy walls that are available in the fences add-on. And uh, there we go. I've got some tricks to show you on how I achieve this. If we look under the station, uh, you'll notice that it doesn't have its shoes on or its feet. I wanted to just get an idea and see if we could put some buildings up there. And I will show you how that was achieved. There's a neat little trick you can do. Let's just get straight into it, shall we? There's a neat little trick you can do with the buildings I was using. And then said, oh, we can't put them in. We've got office, we've got commercial industrial uh, let's get the brick one so i can show you now let's just uh, go up here i don't know where we're putting these it just <laughs> we're just gonna squeeze them in wherever i mean it, it's not 100 percent accurate and we don't quite have the mods available to make a true recreation but that would mean people making mods specifically for the midlands we could get a bit artistic with this given that it's on a slant but I do want to show you what I found out. If we put it there. This is sort of representing the shopping centre thingy. There we go. So we can put that in there. That looks nice. I mean, we only need the essence of it, really. And if you look under here, we've got a problem. But here's the trick I found. Look at this. You can delete that. And that stays. You can also delete the roof separately. So that was brilliant. When I found out you could do that, ignore that this is a bit monkey we probably won't see it anyway but yes when i found that out that was great news that means i'd only just noticed i'm getting distracted now the fans are working on the top that's brilliant oh, i love these but yes there's there's the monstrosity that is walsall and it's it's come along quite nicely i do want to see if we can get the multi-story car park in some form or other about here it goes off at an angle and then we're going to need a building there uh, there should be a road behind it but given our space i would rather not do that so there we go that is that is how far we've got as i said i was going to go under here and put all the uh the, this is a bit close isn't it that's awkward we might get away with it i don't like that but <laughs> It should be okay. It'll just... Oh, it's going to clip, isn't it, when we're on the train rides? Oh, dear. I'll tidy that up. I'll tidy that up. There is a way to do that. We can... I can shrink it down and have a little bit of texture under there. And there we go. Now, it was said... This is probably not... Well, it's not quite how it goes. It's very close. This is pretty much accurate. And... And this is... Although a terminating station uh, platform for the Warsaw trains from Birmingham, it doesn't actually terminate there. Given our space, this should cater for all of the services that we have. And then we're straight into that junction, as you can see. Right then, let's head up this way. I had a, I had a bit of an idea for how I could achieve this, this multi-story car park thing going on. That's not going to work, is it? What are you doing? Put that there. Do we need catenary on for a building? Not really. Right, so we're going to put this in. And, and that's roughly where the multi-story car park is. We're going to need some more built of these buildings around here. They're going to look a bit samey. But like I said, we're limited to our selection of buildings. And we're going to we're going to do this as well. We're going to try and get this, this junction done. We've got to split that way and that way and cross over now the junction in work that i need to do isn't going to be the same because it it won't allow us to do it it's one of the niggles i've got with catenary and certain junction types on or switch types with uh, the current iteration of transport fever perhaps it will be will be fixed or remedied or a, a better solution for Transport Fever 2, but we don't know. So we're just going to do this and start heading around here. I would imagine it's not fast. Now, I've been informed, I would say reliably informed, that the speed limit all the way up to Rugeley is 60 for these this section of track on the chase line. I'm not going to argue with that. It would kind of suit it, I would say, and it, it would... It would be okay for me. I think we can do that quite easily. 
what we'd have to do is if we uh, scoot down to here, we do have, do we have 60? I think we do, don't we? Yeah, there we go. High speed track 60. If we get our, our magic wand, we should be able to. This is this section's probably slower, but uh, we're going to put those in like that and hopefully it all works. If not, well, it, it didn't, did it? I'm going to have to check. I don't think there are any crossovers here. I'll have to check that later. I completely forgot about that. We've got some interesting track layouts, don't we now? And that's what we're going to have to work on. Given that the uh, the next video we get from Urban Games will be the release date, Tom said during the, the final developer video diary. I'm looking forward to that. That's probably much slower around there, so we'll, we'll pick some speeds for that. I'll probably see if we can find some videos on the actual speeds but there you go it's all 60 mile an hour now and there goes our lovely 313s that are now limited to 60 obviously we can't see yet oh that's going in reverse these do reverse in and out of the station but it messes up the the front camera when it's going the opposite way and, eh, minor niggle minor niggle so what do we think is, is this sort of becoming uh, reminiscent of Warsaw? We're going to need a, a parking area here. We've got some bus stops to put in just here. You'll see I've adjusted the road slightly. It's not quite as aggressive that side. This side will still need some work. I'll, I'll get around to doing that. Back to here. And then we'll get to the junctions. But here, this is going to be our, our favourite tools. However, we're going to be not using the bridge and dam construction we're going to be using the stone works and and probably probably that one and we're going to make it xx xxl there we go this will be the parking area the multi-story car park that goes there it's actually really not quite like that is it there's there's a there's an extra bit here let's pick the texture first for this first bit i would like to just get this this main structure in all right so i went charging on with that and it was horrible for some reason nothing lined up yes i know so i went in and put all this ballast in in various <laughs> various orientations to get it until it was perfectly straight what i ended up doing was as many of you will know if you try to draw a straight line the track will will attempt to smooth off any curves, which is not ideal when you're trying to get right angles or anything like that for building. Obviously, not what track's really intended for, so you you can get away with it by using this and flattening it out. If it's on a perfectly flat piece of, piece of ground, it tends to work okay, as I eventually got it done. Yes, it's a monstrosity, but maybe we can move forward now. That's all that was for. Who knows? This is plan B. Plan A just got ditched. The problem is I got to the point where it was super wonky. And I mean, it was unbearable for me to look at. So, yes, I went in and did that. I put, why are we putting trees in? Don't put trees in. I went in and did that. I've got the flooring. And so I've kind of got it about right. We're going to go a little bit artsy on it just so everything lines up okay i mean it's a bit it's a bit jumpy and stuff but yeah we're gonna we're gonna get like the essence of a parking area in as you can see it's not too bad is it it's not too bad at all if we put this in it has like a little shelf over it which i'm i'm willing to accept at this point i don't think we can get really any further it's going to be sticking... Well, I guess we could have it sticking over the other end. I do like the texture that we've got going on. But what we need to do is make sure we can get the other section going across this side. Yes. That I didn't check. But I may, may actually try something different if it doesn't go in. Anyway, let's get the floors on where we were before. Uh, we're going to make it a little bit... A little bit lower, then we're going to shove it up to the eight. Oh, it's going to be about eight, right? Something along there, probably a bit more. If we just do ten, it should hopefully 
balance out either end. Come on, you can do it. How's that looking? Is that looking... That's looking multi-storey car parky, isn't it? Yeah, that'll do. Switch it around that way. Can we line this up, please? Does that line up okay? I think it does. Right, and our next one, we're going to need... Plus eight, I believe, will give us something close to where we need it. That's a bit too much, isn't it? Six? Maybe six. That's not where you want it. <laughs> that was awful. Right. You want to try that again? And this time get it, like, on top. Oh, that's not... No, eight would have been it. It's because it was, it was all the angles. Very deceiving. It's not easy. Is that... Is that looking uniform enough? Oh, you know... I think it's coming together. I saved you from what I went through. I really did. It would have been an, it would have been an hour special of me just trying to get this ground flat. There we go. I just hope now that we can go across the other side. If not, we'll do something at the ends and make it look okay by the end of it. I'm going to go off and put finishing touches to it. Don't worry. We are going to get this junction started at the very least. And then we've got to put some... Plus 58's in. Well, is that all? 56 is one of the two. It, it's been so long ago. It's literally been an hour. Yeah, I just scrapped it. <laughs> an hour of video. It got to the, the 45 minute point in just doing this. I was like, that's not that's not fun. Or even correct. It just wasn't. It, nothing lined up. I, I don't know whether I can edit that in. I don't, I'm not sure if I've got the footage. It's good though. It's good. It, it was a it was a trial and error thing, and it was an error. Okay, what are we doing? What are we doing? Get get this. We need to shrink this back down. No, not that. That was fine. We need it not to be x x x x x. Yes, we need it to be that. And those. Oh yeah, the. I don't think these are going to line up. Regard. Oh, they might. Ooh, they might actually line up. Can we? We make that the shorter. What's the shortest we can go here? I bet I got this wrong. Uh, can we make that super? No, that's the wrong one. You're doing the wrong one. Leave that one alone. Work on this one. Uh, what's the longest? Can we put that on long. No. So you need to go XX and then super short. Oh, get in there. It's not quite right, but we could we could do something kind of cool with it. I feel like if we. If we go like that, that's what we call in the business close enough. Oh, it's it's nice. No, I'll take it. Okay, let's let's take the base down. Not drop the base, that's something different. But let's take the base down. Hopefully it's not too terrible. Yes, we can cover these these weird jaggy out bits at the end. You know what? I think I'll take it. Can we do the same this side? You know what? We can. We can. If we have them uniform on on the ends, well, it doesn't matter if we're gonna if we're gonna do it. But if we can, can we get the? Yes, we can do it that way round. So this side's kind of pretty, and the other side's kind of not. We can hide the not so pretty. As you see, we're leaving it playing because hopefully the AI can't build over this. I don't think they can. I, I've pretty much dealt with them in that in that case. I mean, we could go like, no, that's, it's either one or the other, isn't it? It's a bit skoo wonky. That's not a word. Is now. Skoo wonky. It's, it's an awful word. Don't ever use that. Right, get in there. Now what do we do? We, we put this to normal, please? Maybe? Ooh, is that going to fit? Surely you're going to fit. There, there, I saw it. I can hear the trains in the background. It's awesome. Right, put that there. And put that in there. And I'm excited. Yes, it's not brilliant. But, you know, my voice went very high then. Didn't know it could go that high. Let's do that. I'll, I'll settle for that. Not that one. Don't want to break everything. I will be saving this at some point. You'll notice I've put uh, crossways sections in underneath like I said, it doesn't matter what's happening on this side. We'll make that work as long as the other side. There it is. There it is. If we put it in like there. Yes. 
I'm, I'm going to take it. I'm going to take it. Right, now we need to get this all the way across somehow. Don't know how we do that without it going... Oh, get in. Get in again. I'm using this middle section. We don't have much room. It's a little bit... It's a little bit tight. Oh, and then we... Have we run out? No, we're good. We got it. Yes, this is not... This is not going to be an episode of me doing this. I absolutely promise. Although it was. I just ha just sort of edited it out a little bit. <laughs> or a lot of it. Oh, that's not good. I can't get that to... Come on. Wait. Do I have this? Yeah, this is all changed. We could maybe shift this down to zero. Get that about spot on. Oh, you're beautiful. You're, you're in. There, look, he's got a floor and everything. And then you can do... It's not quite how multi-story car parts work, but uh, we're going to get the idea, aren't we? We certainly are. Now then, what do we need to add on here? Ten? Ten and drop two meters off. One, three, four. I think that's it, isn't it? That's it right there. So if we put that in just there. Oh, we might be able to just leave it at that. This end might be awkward. Maybe not. Yeah, that end might be awkward. No, is that perfect? Oh, get in. You get in there. Oh, I've got an X site now, guys. It went from misery, my end, to happiness. Because this is going in. And you will, uh... I think you'll see here that it, it, it'll do, wouldn't it? Maybe we can get some cars in there. I don't know. We could do some stuff with it. Have I made that a bit too wibbly-wobbly? I have. Let's not do that. If you're going to do it, do it properly. That's my motto. <laughs> well, it's not, is it? If you're going to do it, do it close to being almost perfect. It'll do. Yes. Not a thing. Right, you go in there. You go in there. And hopefully you'll fill in the gaps. Is that a car park? I think it is, isn't it? It it, it sort of is. It's, it's not right, but it, it's there. What do you reckon, guys? That's the gist of it. We can put some stuff in there. We can cover things up. I mean, you can get uh, you can get something like this. Uh, head to this one and get the the brick material. I mean, you could you could have different coloured brick, couldn't you, and mix it up a little bit so it looks like a building. And then you can raise that up to maybe thirty. Not that much. That's crazy. Maybe ten, twenty. If we put it out at 20, what you can do is hide stuff and make it look a bit car parky at the end. You see? You hide hide quite a bit of the gubbins, don't you? Don't mind that. You can do the same that side. Like so. Like that. There you go. It's, it's sort of a car park, guys. It's about the 90th attempt of this recording. Well, you get to see the end product-ish. It's not finished. I will tidy that up. But I'm happy with it. I believe I just slurped my tea. Anyway. Let's get into here. There's a there's another little bit that's on here which I wanted to do. I love the I love how that turned out, guys. I really do. You know, in fact, I'm going to celebratory save that. Alright, that's been saved. Let's do it. There's another little bit I want to do here. Ignore the catenary there. That's not supposed to be there. Uh, I want to get us this one. Is it that one? Or is it... Or is it that one? I don't know. It's the... It's the... Oh, what are you doing up there? Let's reset all this. And I'll figure it out. It's it's the long beam. We actually want to be in here, don't we? Yeah, it's this one. And it wants to be... There we go. Got it. This is the one we need. And we want it to be like... Maybe 18. I don't That's a bit too long. That's a bit too long. You can go with it like that. You're not going to sit right. Have I changed this? No. We might be able to get this sitting right. You're not going to. Ooh. Don't do it to me. Why can't you sit in the middle? Can you sit in the middle? I mean. Maybe. 
We could freehand it, couldn't we? That would be easier. Don't don't mess about. You don't need it perfect. Right. So do we want that? Not that. It is this small one. We want to go page up. Uh, we'll need it a little bit. Get rid of that too. Okay, now we need the right texture, which is concrete. We want it underneath. There's like a couple of little feet that I wanted to put in. Let's get the uh, orientation right. You're a bit skew whiff. Or a lot skew whiff. Hold shift again. Is that... You're not quite... I need to bring you down. Ooh, is that... Ooh, is that like perfect? It's not quite, is it? What about height? Does that make it easier on us? Yeah, that's easier. Okay, do we have it lined up nice? Stop snapping, really. I would love it if you stop snapping. I don't know what you're snapping to. Should we get rid of this? We can always put it in again. There we go. Oh, that's easier. Why don't you just do that, you plonker? Oh, as the train arrives. Yeah, there's a couple of things just here. I would like to make that short. Yes, that's better. On this side. Okay, we just got to get it about right in the centre. Like so. And then another one. Just there. Is that it? It's in. That's all I wanted to do. I mean, we could get we could get daring and put shoes on it because there are a couple of shoes with a with the lighter texture that we don't have in this one. Oh, that should have been this one. Don't <laughs> don't change it. You got it in. Right, if we go into here then, can we make shoes? Can we shrink this all the way down and make shoes for it? Probably not. Don't be wonky. Be there. And yes. At this point I'll take it. And there. That I'm not taking. That looks like they just threw it in and didn't care. But I do care a little bit. Alright. In. I can't see my shoes. I'm not sure about that. They're they're all sorts of Well, they they're facing the same way. I want them almost like that. I just don't want to delete anything above. Oh, just stop. I'll do it off camera, but that's what I'm going to do. No, I can't. Just take them out. They're so close to being in, aren't they? It's just really difficult to get things lined up in, in Transport Fever. We, you can do that one, but I can't zoom in enough for the other one. Come on. Come on, you just... Oh, dear. This was such a good idea. I might just put one big shoe. Or is that it? Don't let me down. Is that it? That, that's it. The shoes are on. Oh, they're all sorts of wonky at the bottom. Right, don't look at it any longer. But there we go, we've got shoes in. <laughs> we've, we've got this in. Should we put a class... What do you reckon, guys? Are you happy about that? I th we're going to have to leave this. There is absolutely no way I'm getting that monstrosity in. We can get the crossovers in. Now, we're going to have to uh, improvise a little bit here because we simply... Don't want to use ballast. Don't do that. We simply don't have enough room. And we don't have uh, enough control over the catenary to make it work either. There is a certain, a certain switch crossover that doesn't work and it's that one. And what it does is it sometimes puts these, I mean that's too close anyway, puts them over the track. And then technically that's what that should be. Not what I'm doing here. So, I mean, if it works, I could get one in and not the other, but I don't think it will. Oh, are you going to prove me wrong? I don't mind. Because that makes my life a little easier. Beautiful. Okay, we've got that in. Which means we have a little bit more room back here, providing this doesn't wreck everything. Because that is going to have to go off that way. And this one's going to have to go off that way. I think we'll be alright. I think we'll be alright. I'm, I'm a little confident. Oh, it's big. No, see? Do you know? You didn't put catenary on. Anybody shouting at me? You did not put catenary on. And now it's going to mess the feet up, I bet. Okay. Or not. That's fine. That is fine. I like it. We're in. Okay, we might be able to make this work. I'm more confident. 
As long as it doesn't mess up the, the catenary poles when I put this in. Yep. Yes. This one here is supposed to do the same. But given that I've just got that in and we don't have any any poles, I know there is an add-on to remove them. But if we just take a look at the network, let's put on the line manager. If we just take a look at the network there, we only want to uh, rail. Um, I mean, you can't even zoom out and see it. Hide the, uh, hide the UI there. Look at it all. A lot of this is catenary. I am not doing that. I'm not manually putting in catenary for that much of a network. I'm not, to be honest. I'm not sure how the... Uh, well, that was laggy. I'm not sure how the add-on works that removes them. I, I like this. That's that's looking good. We've got some detailing to do around here. And this is going to connect up. I've just got to hunt around for some buildings for that. But I think uh, I think we're on to a winner there. Now, this is going to branch off this way. You are definitely going to have to go. And I would like to get it gone as soon as possible. And it's going to be extremely exaggerated and much slower than it probably is in real life. This has to go straight. Oh, if we can get this in, I'll be super, super happy. This is really going to have to start shifting around now. Like, super, super fast. I don't know how we're going to get these in. It would be nice without the messy itinerary, but I'm not sure. Oh, do you know? I can't... Ooh. Ooh. We, we kind of got it in. Guys, guys. It, it's it's sort of happening. I stand corrected. It is sort of happening. This is going to be... This is going to have to be exaggerated. We've got to head back up to... We've got to fit the, the M6 and... This is going to be so close, isn't it? This is going to be so close. We're going to have to maybe swing all the way back round because we need to head back up that way it's not how it does it actually heads down but hands hamsteads up there that's what we've got to aim for it's fine it's fine it is not i would have preferred to have it accurate but we're going to have to go this way this is just the way we're going to have to go because this this heads out I think it's something like this. I'm just putting them in temporary for now. But it, it heads that way. The question is, I don't know how I'm going to fit the M M6 in there. Going to have to swing round and over? Maybe. Maybe. you got the best got mess all around here. And we've got the, the football ground uh, somewhere around there. But we'd definitely have to head that way. The main line would be there. We'd definitely have to go that way. This is we're, we're putting it in as a as a an idea of where we need to be because we're we're here. This has got to come round like that. Yes, maybe, maybe, because then we could go round and meet it, couldn't we? Where is it? Up there. Okay. Maybe. It might work. Maybe. I don't know. We're going to connect it up. And then we're going to see what the state of play is for next week. Because we've got a couple of stations to get in. Hampstead we're, we're north of right now. Uh, can we connect that up pretty easily? No, of course you can't. Why would you? Why would you be able to connect that up just simply? That's not how it works. Do you reckon it's worth starting a bridge... At this section of the game. It's not even a bridge that exists. That I'm aware of. I just want it connected. So it might build on the other side. Don't do that one. Lower that down. Both sides. Here we go. Lovely. Did you build a bridge for me? Nope. It, I mean it is a bit low. Let's face it. In fact it's really low. Probably a bad idea. Maybe we can get one across here. And go straight. And just do that. Yes, we can probably do that if we make a bit of room for it either side. Just to maybe encourage them to build across the other side. 
hopefully shrink that shrink that down we'll uh we'll drop that down a touch do this over here hold shift just touch that up a little bit it doesn't matter if it's a little bit of a humpback does it there we go accept that just put it in get you connected get you connected back up it's not how it's going to be fear not oh well i mean if we would have gone from this side you plonker that poor dude he just drove there yeah you th don't worry we're, we're fixing the road he's like well guess i'm not doing anything then today am i no you're not but we're gonna we're gonna make this work even though it's only temporary i'm gonna make it work maybe this will look better anyway in the end oh yes that, that is better you're coming out that way go flat swing that around there uh, more official oops nope that's an un un unofficial episode but this is official there we go lovely are we are we happy we've got a connection there because i would like hamster to grow on the other side we're, we're all sorts of gone the wrong angle what's happened is we've we've dropped down here we've gone crazy on the detailing would have had to sh shift everything up but considering we've got the massive foresty area there that that wouldn't have been a happy place for me it's not too bad it just should have gone more that way and in but do you know are we happy is that a good outline do you reckon we can fit some sort of bescotty sidings going on here and the station and maybe the football ground in there I feel like that's going to work for us, guys. We're nearly towards 1984. We're going to leave that there. We've got this junction in. It pretty much does what it needs to do. I think that's everything that needs, needs to be done there. We can put a signal in so we know what we're doing. You're going to be one way. That's going there. That will be going one way, that way. This is much more aggressive than it should be. However, I'll take it. This is going to be two-way, isn't it? Because that is a terminus. We can stick one there that is one way. I don't think traffic goes the opposite way. I, I'm i loving it. I really am. That, that turned out okay. <laughs> I'm a little bit surprised, but I'm, I'm, I'm happy. I'm happy. That can be two-way looking at that mess of junctions and they might use it to turn around sometimes don't think they turn around that way it'll be more going this way and one way like so Ooh, what we got we've still got to put those trains in we've got mercedes-benz buses 0405 0405 and we've got american airlines boeing 74757s and a Boeing 757 and I don't know what livery that is but there yes oh we're not going to fit them all in are we we're not going to fit them all in do you know what I would like to do though I know we've we've, we've cutting it a bit fine I know someone someone did notice I noticed someone did notice it, it works doesn't it it's a sentence that the last two episodes have been 45 minutes and one second I don't think we're going to keep that up. Possibly not. But what I would like to do... By the way, guys, we're keeping these on for now. I know there are bigger ones available, but these actually carry more on based on the length of, of the carriage and how much it can carry. But we're keeping those on because food is a problem. I think that's, that's right. Yes, they, you, you can carry far, far more than you can your your bigger bulkier counterpart where where's our train i'm trying to find the other the other steam trains because i want to get a want to get a new freight train on it's another diesel we have the fuel oh what about the fuel the fuely train where are you where are you i'd love to get this on uh, kingsbury oil replacements yes right we're redoing this with this train where are you at the moment that that's the line that's not going to tell you <laughs> oh dear vehicles there you are 
We might have to put more on. Where are you currently heading? You're currently heading... Ooh, you're currently heading to... Pause that. This guy is going to head up there and, and, and drop off some oil. Uh, some fuel. Not oil. Let's get you replaced then. We're going to get rid... We're going to just dump the lot. Doo -doo -doo. Yep, you're going to be modernized with a locomotive. You want uh, diesel because we are going to add the EWS uh, Class 58 or should we have British Rail? Let's, should we go British Rail? Kind of looks the part, doesn't it? We're going to add one of those on and we've got some new uh, some new oil wagons -y things. Yes, there we go, fuel wagons. They need to be mixed, so we'll add one, two, three, four of those, maybe three of those some of these two of those and then we'll put some more total on and then a couple more but maybe in black or something at the end 212 is too long we might struggle with that we'll put it at 197 i think that will be good for us though you currently carry a boatload i'm not sure what the the new capacity will be replace now we'll, we'll take a look what is that that's two of two of three eight four What's the details? Let's have a look. What's the capacity? It should tell you somewhere, right? No. No, you don't. I thought you did. I thought it uh, showed you the... I mean, it says it here, but I meant the actual number. Because I don't want to do math. It's it's towards the end of the episode. Well, it does 384 plus 24, so a little over 400. It'll be 408. Yeah, close enough. That's because that's right. Okay. That is going to be a new uh, class class 58 on our line. Our first class 58. I keep saying 58, and do you know what I see in my mind? 56, which is unfortunate because it is a 58. So there we go, guys. We we did a bit. We did a bit over here. We're going to quickly shoot back over there. Where's Walsall? How's that looking? That's... Yes. I'm, I'm, I'm looking forward to finish the detailing on this. It was a bit of a monster to build. And that's mainly because of lining it up. But that's the basis of something fantastic. We also learned about that little trick that you can do with those houses. And delete the bases so that you can have them above stations. Which might bode well for here. We might be able to put some up there. Because it needs more buildings. Here comes our train. He's going to pull in here and drop off a lot of fuel for our Volvo trucks. I think what we do on Thursday, make up for it. We make up for my uh, overly excessive... Let's hide this. I think we could end it here. That has been episode 222. Two, two. Not 2. 102. That's better. It's been episode 102. We'll be better off seeing it come out from this angle. It's laggy. It has been episode 102. We, we, I got a lot done as far as setting up that nice bit of scenery that we're going to have going. We also got the junction in. And we've also got our very first Class 58 train in. Which is going to happen anytime soon. <laughs> I probably won't end it here. Because it's quite quiet as loads of trains turn up. But I guarantee... No, you can see them in the background. Do you know what? I like it. There we go. There's the class 58. <laughs> uh, he's got a lovely horn. He's carrying loads of goods. We'll check up on him. We'll replace some trains and some vehicles, road vehicles, and maybe some planes on Thursday. So it's going to be a bit, bit more of a, a, a maintenance-y type thing. I'll do some more work on Walsall in between episodes, and we'll take a look at that too. And maybe we'll get uh, at least one of the stations, perhaps perhaps Hampstead or something. I'm not sure on how I'm going to have to have a real think about that. Thank you for watching, guys. Uh, if we look out there, we can probably see loads of trains. I'll see you Thursday. I'm not sure on the length of this one because I have got some serious edit editing to do. <laughs> Teeth. Editing to do with that one. Any bets on uh, if the trains are going to completely dry up when I when I leave you with a bit of a view? I'm going to say possibly. So until next time, take care.